Hey guys, so today I'm going to be showing you my August favorites and I know everyone says this at their um, monthly favorites video but I cannot believe August flew by. This was actually the first month of summer that actually really flew by for me. I don't know why but it is. Um, before we get down to the business of my products and all that and whatnot, I wanted to ask you guys what would... I'm serious, I think you'll see this in like an upcoming video, I might have already said this in like a video that will be posted after this one, but I'm going to ask you in this video, what color would you say is my overall hair color? Would you say that my overall hair color is brunette or blonde? I'd like to know. This is it, um, yeah. It's obviously color treated as you can tell, but you know, I'd like to know what the dyed color is. Thank you, and I enjoy your comments, so yeah. So let's just get into it. Um, most of the beauty products and stuff that I have are, no, half of them are raved about and the other half are like those really good jewels that are never raved about. So the first thing is something that is never raved about and it's like my favorite product ever. It is a cream blush and I like never wore blush before I found this one and I hated cream blushes specifically until I found this one. But this is the Kevin Aquan cream blush and it is in the shade Pravella and it's spelled P-R-A-V-E-L-L-A. And it's just this beautiful hot pink color I'm wearing it right now and I absolutely adore it and it's just beautiful and yeah I will by the way I will have all the products linked down below but anyways this is like my favorite product like ever it's like I've been wearing it every day of August like no other blush sorry other blushes no actually except for in my school photo I think I don't know I can't remember but whatever that video is already up doesn't matter <laughs> Um, so the next product is um, a mattifying powder and is the Rimmel Stay Matte Powder. And as you can tell, I have hit a pan so hard on this, you guys don't even know. So obviously like the pore packaging, I had to tape this pore cap here. Like it's pore packaging, but this is like the freaking best powder ever. So yeah, I've obviously hit pan hard. It's really inexpensive. It's under $5 and... I would buy, tw if they said they were discontinuing this tomorrow, I would buy like 50 of these so I can have for the rest of my life. I'm not even joking. So the next product is commonly raved about, I think, on YouTube, and it is the Cap on D Tattoo Eyeliner, and yeah, it's in the shade Trooper, and it's just a black liquid eyeliner, and here's a swatch. And yeah, I just love it. It like really just applies easy. Like I can just do it like this. Like, I'm like Jedi mode and I just like swipe it on in the morning. I'm like, bam, can't beat that, huh? Huh? So anyways, yeah. So I really like this eyeliner. It's my favorite eyeliner. I used to use the Maybelline Light Stiletto, which was very good, but this is better. So yeah, I highly recommend this and it is amazing and it is worth the money. I use it every single day. There's no other eyeliner that I would prefer over this one. So the next beauty product is a skincare product and it is the Olay um, Complete All Day Moisturizer Sunscreen blah, blah, blah. and um, my skin has been terrible lately. I have a bunch of acne, I don't know if you can, the camera's picking it up but I have like a bunch of acne right now and a bunch of dry patches so but this is good if you have oily skin or dry skin. I have very dry skin and this is like the best cream day and night. It is perfect. It's the be hands down best face cream you can ever have. And it's just best and it it was $6.99 at Bed Bath & Beyond and it's just I cannot tell you guys how much I love this product like I seriously this is gonna be in my holy grail video if I make one hopefully it will it's one of my holy grail products and I just cannot express how great this moisturizer is so the next product is a hairspray and it is the Sebastian Shaper spray um, this is the breast cancer one as you can tell it's a really tall bottle it's like very tall you know and here's just what it looks like I like it because it doesn't make your hair feel crunchy but it really holds in your hair and yeah it's good got it for 10 bucks pretty good so the next product is a eyeshadow palette and this is like a very commonly raved about eyeshadow palette and I've had it for like since it literally came out but like it's like I was really into it in February and then I just kind of forgot about it and like sticked with a different different set of neutrals on my eyes until now in this month I've just been wearing this palette every day I just um the video that I posted on Friday 
what um, I use this palette so and I used it in my get ready with me for picture day I think so um, it is the naked 3 palette and by Urban Decay and here's just what it looks like it's a set of neutrals there's a naked 1 and naked 2 I can make a video about the difference between naked 1 2 and 3 but here's just the colors um, the biggest difference I'd have to say between this palette and the naked 1 and naked 2 palette is that these are more like pinky rose gold tones and yeah so I don't know I don't know if you guys can see but my skin undertone is actually a warm undertone so um, I think that the rose gold looks really pretty um, so yeah I've just been wearing it every day I've been wearing um, I guess like not really these colors but more like dust does my base highlight you know these in my crease sometimes getting the darker shades if I'm feeling it so yeah that was the colors so the next thing is um, I don't know how much and many of you guys are into cheer comment down below if you are um, so comment down below if you are and comment down below if you want any cheer video videos but I'm going to show you guys my favorite cheer bow of this month and even if you're not into cheerleading this is like the freaking best bow ever it's a princess Ariel bow it's like the cutest thing ever so this um, quarter of it is glittery and then this has a picture of Ariel and like this is just like um you know like the scenery and background of her and then this part's glittery and it's like the cutest bow I've ever had um comment down below if you want a bow collection but I just sitting so cute sorry I like Ariel is like my, my favorite Disney princess and my little brother's name is Ariel so yeah I don't know I love this bow it's my like hands down favorite bow so yeah so my next product, I actually don't have any more products, but I have a pair of shoes and I've had these forever, but I don't know why I've been just wearing them every day this month because I've been really late and like need to get out the door, but it's my rainbows and these are so worn out. You can see my foot has imprinted to them greatly and um, yeah, I just slip these on when I need, I'm on the run. So yeah, these are just the lighter ones in the thicker strap, no braid. I just love these and they're the most comfortable shoes ever. Like if you have to get one pair of flip flops for the rest of your life, get rainbows. And they actually provide support for your foot, so that's good. Wow, this video is like one of the longest videos I've ever filmed. Okay, so the last thing is, and I just wanna say that Miss Megan Makeup, who's one of my favorite YouTubers, uh, had something like this in her favorites video and I'm like that's interesting I've never ha seen anyone have food in their video so this is something similar to what she had and it's the dryers outshine fruit bars and they're so yummy so this there's a strawberry raspberry and tangerine my favorite is strawberry second is raspberry and third is tangerine and I just love these and they're so they're so yummy it's stuck it's stuck oh that's not even the flavor I wanted. Wow. Um, here's the flavor I want. So here, they're just super delicious and they're like no calories. They are 25 calories for a single one. And it is, sh there's only one gram of sugar. That's like nothing. So yeah, it's sweet and those Splenda and it's like the best thing ever. I don't know if you have this in the East Coast because the safe way, no, no, the safe way. The supermarkets we have in California and like in the West Coast are apparently different than the ones in the East Coast, so I've heard. So yeah, comment down below what's your local supermarket if you care. Um, I'm probably gonna get no comments about that, but comment down below what's your local supermarket if you decide to. Okay, so that was my, that was my August, not July, August favorites. So let me know um, if you have any video requests or anything I can do to improve my videos. Um, please like and subscribe. And yeah, so I will have all the products linked down below. And so thanks for watching. Bye, lovelies. Hey guys, so I forgot to mention some favorites. So I decided to insert it right now. So um, they're just music favorites i know i had to make this video so unprofessional this is that the camera sitting on my lap i know i had to make it so unprofessional so i could read you these songs but i have to say that i love the song it was always you by maroon 5 it's like my favorite song ever and then um i really like the song uh dante by the chain smokers and um i know this is like a super old song it's like in every movie but i love the song like why can't we be friends like why can't we be friends you know that song the creepy stalker song jk anyways those are my songs you know 
thanks for um, the interruption. The PSA was very important. JK, okay, we're going to leave. Bye, thanks. <laughs> so today I'm going to be talking to you about the thing that happens at the end of the month. Okay, that's on that doesn't sound right. Okay. What? <laughs> what is this? Okay, I cannot like I cannot remember what I was gonna film this video about. Like legitimately, like oh wow, well, I'm stupid. Okay. Hey guys, so today I'm going to be showing you my July favorites. It's not July! Ugh!